So Steve Killerley, President of the Institute for Economics and Peace, thank you very much for joining us. Uh, as you know, PS4 has some research coming out this week looking at rising global deaths from conflict. Is the world getting more dangerous and why? Well, I think if we look over the last seven years, the world has become 5% less peaceful. That's been driven by two trends. Increases in homicides, which is gradually going up, and increases in death from terrorism, which has risen dramatically over the last two years. And they're the two major dynamics, fueling a slight drop in peacefulness globally. Is there a broader knock-on effect from the global financial crisis here? I think probably not. I think there has been some effects from it, and you can see that in Greece, so that's probably most evident there. You can also see it in some of the aspects of the Arab Spring, like possibly what's gone in in Egypt, but if we look at the major conflicts today, and where we've got most of the terrorist activity, there are other dynamics driving it other than the global financial crisis. When you look at the world in general, are you optimistic or pessimistic on this front? I'm neither optimistic nor pessimistic. Uh, I think that the, the Middle East, we're going to see a, 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 a things get worse before they get better. Uh, I think a, there's a shift going on in the dynamics, and this is relating to uh, the Sunni Shiite a, a, a political uh, dynamics in the area. How it's all going to unfold, we don't really know as yet. Long-term prognosis I'd be fairly confident on, other than the way uh, things like uh, resource scarcity and climate change is going to fuel into the global dynamics of conflict. And finally, you're an experienced entrepreneur on the philanthropic side. What's your impression has been of PS21 in its first month? Well, I'm pretty impressed so far. It's a, a good reports coming out, uh, high-quality people who are joining the advisory board. So I'm looking forward to some great research over the next couple of years. Thank you very much.